this bar of we'll come back to that but that's a, another very interesting moment as you see the other games do not detain him at all it's a piece of cake strolling round mowing down the opposition annihilating them obliterating them pulverizing them yes well his resistance has been good and it's not going to help and that's yeah um, this is um, fairly one-sided yeah yeah a couple of those central pawns of, of white they're extra pawns, they're past pawns, they're connected past pawns, and they're going through. So Bart De Wever is a um, coalition partner, isn't he? Chris Peters. And, uh, he's not, not played badly, but um, not sufficiently well. You need to play on an extremely high level to have any chance at all. Um, and he, his chess has been OK, but... Um, not quite up to the job and as you see this is just yeah there are lots of uh, uh, people shaking their heads and you understand it yeah that's Nico Ni Nicola Capone who's resigned lost uh, he's setting up the pieces there I'm sure he's enjoyed the um, experience Learned a lot. When I was a youngster, I played various simultaneous uh, in simult on the uh, simultaneous exhibitions by myself. I think uh, when I was uh, nine years old, I played against Lajos Portish, one of the greats. I managed to draw with him. And when I was 10, I played against uh, Victor Korchnoi, who was uh, number two in the world at that time. And um, I beat him. I also lost in some exhibitions. I lost to world champion Vasily Smyslov. Yeah, well, yeah, Tongi has uh, gone down. Uh, yeah, OS. QB is his company. He's an architect. Third time here. Oh well. Another one. Catherine DeVos. Put up some resistance. Uh, yeah, here it is. Mm bit of a massacre. Yeah, they're all falling. Martin Vinkers from KDG. Yeah, he's resigned. Yeah, he was um, he was lost. Yeah, that's true. He was lost, but um, Excellent, excellent play. Yeah. Chris Lankrit is playing, I mean, quite frankly, he's playing great chess. He's, uh, he's not worse at all. He can put his king on g7. He can even play a5. He's, uh, he's got uh, control of the... Um, 
uh, he's got control of the D file for the moment. And so um, he should be doing absolutely fine. He is doing fine. I know he's doing fine. Now, will he have the um, tenacity to um, to hang on? Yeah, this is a game we haven't really seen too much of. Um, the basic problem is that white has an extra rook. And if it were not for that small detail, you know, a rook being worth five points, black would be doing fine. Unfortunately, you can't afford to be a rook down. Yeah. And Yoris, uh, he tired of um, defending passively, and he decided he had to take action. He sacrificed a piece, and... I think what we'll find now is that Gary, instead of launching... Oh, no, uh, the moment I spoke, the guy does something completely different. But actually, he just uh, has diffused um, the black um, initiative on the, um, on the king side and um, saying, well, OK, you're not doing anything here. I've got an extra piece. And now he's opening up the, um, opening up the game. King G7, X, I, I couldn't have played it better myself. Brilliant stuff. He might have G3. I, maybe Gary's going to play G3 now. Uh, not. E5 is good. Actually, black... Isn't black better here? Doesn't black have an advantage? If this would be Kasparov with black, I think white would be uh, worried here. The uh, the key point of this position is the extra knight on f7. It's not white's uh, only advantage, but uh, uh, yeah, another one down. Ton Coppens from Netlog. see a great deal of that game. I hope Sam enjoyed his experience. It's a great opportunity to play a chess legend like Kasparov. A finesse that wasn't wasn't really necessary, but uh, anyway. Oh, he was about to blunder. Oh, he. Rook d1. Hmm. Exchanging queens. Actually, maybe there are some, um, no, no. Are there some, possibly some technical difficulties here? Maybe exchanges, no, I, uh, not really. Uh, black has quite a lot of pawns there. Can he put up some sort of miracle defense and sort of, I mean, Gary's there, he's twitching away, though, his fingers, is. Does he exchange off the, uh, the, the queens? Yeah, he's got a lot of pawns, and there is 